Hello everybody, today we will try to save one more power supply. It's 700 watts. Seal is not broken. I are cool. Let's take a tester, connect it, connect the power cord that goes from isolating transformer. It's turned off. Now I turned on my isolating transformer turn on the power supply and as you can see the PS on light is present which is good but the power supply itself is not turning on and the lamp the safety lamp which is connected in series lights up so definitely we have a problem probably on the primary side here is an indication that there is a sh shirt somewhere let's open it remove the screws let's take off the lead with help of an old screwdriver I like old doesn't mean bad I like it for this purpose on the first side I don't see anything obvious first of all I'm looking at the primary side where probably we have a problem there's some dirt the dead bridge is good nothing here okay we should remove the PCB and test it so I did it let's remove this isolating Piece. Discharge the capacitor, always treat it as charged because the shock is very unpleasant and can be lethal. We know that the fuse is good, we saw the PS on light, so now I'm gonna test transistors, diet bridge, power diets, diodes, someone corrected me that I mispronounce diet. Anyway, let's put it in diode mode and test make sure we're draining sources and we can see a diode drop so it means 90% that the transistors are good okay when we check those next we I forgot to turn on, turn on left light. Maybe it would be better for you to see what I'm doing here. So here is a PFC diode, which we also should check. I don't check diode bridge because, as I said, we have PS on. If that bridge was bad, we wouldn't have PS on and we would have the fuse blown. Again, primary side looking good, so let's check the secondary end. 
it's a shirt on the secondary I should do I should do it right in the beginning before even opening the power supply that was my mistake don't do my mistakes check the outputs right at the beginning anyway let's make sure one more time that there is a shirt and it is so let's examine the board and find the culprit which I did I don't know why I didn't notice it at the first side because it was so obvious here we can see a burned Schottky diet let's remove the radiator I've showed you how you can do it in the previous videos just move back and forth and pull it out and as you can see one diet is definitely bad really bad there were two pieces actually of this diet there are two diets actually in one package and probably it was loose and due to overheating it just takes on fire let's check all the diets this one is good this one is also good good this one is bad the same as this nice decent here is one more perfect and amazing so we should change to elements and everything should be good this is 30 60 CT 30 amps 60 volts I'm gonna put here 60 amps 100 volts twice as much powerful I put it on the radiator as you can see and now I'm gonna put it back solder everything and hope for the best okay here is soldering iron it's t12 i really like it it's not expensive about twenty dollars maybe even less but I like it it's enough for me I do recommend it okay I soldered everything back let's make sure that we don't have shirt anymore and we don't so we are ready to test it You shouldn't do it directly from mains I definitely don't recommend it that is very dangerous as I said I have an isolating transformer connect my tester turn on the power supply green light is here and voila we've got it working one more time everything looks good now I'm gonna put everything back and test
everything is back let's make a final test connect the power cord the tester DIY at first let's check the light bulb how it's gonna behave at this time and it blinks once capacitor is charged let's turn it on light bulb is not lightning let's get a high-tech professional power tester from, Ch from our friends from China it's flickering but it's okay it's I suppose my camera not the best quality also let's stop beeping by connecting 12 volts and everything looks fine we saved it thank you for watching my friends and see you with another one